Braxton, you have Jalen, you have a lot of guys that are in that role who are excellent athletes. How are you all handling balancing the competition to play with, versus getting the opportunity to get the ball in your hands with the, the pressure that puts on you to perform? Uh, <clears throat> well, we have a, lot, a whole bunch of guys that's, that's dynamic at the age. Like you said, Braxton, we've got Jalen, we've got Dontre. So there's a whole bunch of guys that could go out there and make plays. And, you know, everybody, uh, everybody want to go out there and make plays on the field. But uh, like I said, we go out there uh, at practice and we all just produce. We all got to make plays. And as a whole, we got a, a bunch of great guys. And whoever coach going to put out on the field, that's, that's the guy that's going to go out there and make plays. Does that pressure, does that competition help you all through practice through the week where you're not on game day in terms of you know you've got to perform every day because you've got to stand out and, and, and compete with that group of talent? Oh, yeah, I, I could definitely say it's. I wouldn't say it's pressure, but I could. I think it uh, it helps us get better. Uh, competition just bring the, brings the best out of you, and I mean that's what the coaches want to see. I mean you don't want to shy down from competition, so you just live up to it and you just just go out there and perform. When you played running back last year, was the plan? Did you always know you're going to go back to H, or did you have an idea that you'd be going back to H at some point? Oh. Uh. Say that again. When you you, you were a, fr a running back last year, pretty much. Right. Did you assume or have an idea that you'd be moving to H this year, last year? Uh, last year I played a, a whole whole lot of running back, and next year I just figured that I'll be they expand my role a little bit more, get me out there receiver a little bit. But I just think that me playing a uh, running back all last year uh, helped me helped me more because I could motion from, from the slot to in the backfield and still understand the blocking and still understand uh, the whole scheme of the whole play. They recruited you in age. Right. I, uh, when I came in and played running back, it wasn't a problem for me. Uh, wherever I could get out there on the field and help this team win, that's that's what I was happy at. Do you still rep at running back in practice, or are you just repping at age and wide receiver in practice? Well, I practice, I still get some get some reps at uh, running back. She's got to stay sharp just in case. Uh, never know what happened in the game situation. Curtis, what were the conversations like during the game Saturday? Because y'all had all those big plays on Monday night at Virginia Tech. A bunch of you guys had a big play, you know, and right. those didn't come on Saturday and stuff. What were y'all, what were the conversations like, I guess, on the sidelines and maybe afterwards about kind of what went wrong with the plan? Uh, no, we just got to capitalize when is uh, when we get the ball in our hands, when we get the uh, uh, when we get the opportunity. Uh, <clears throat> I can say we didn't have the game that we expected uh, for receivers. We didn't have the game we expected to have. But uh, we just know since we got a, a full week of practice, go out there and just turn it up a little bit. Curtis, do you feel like this I, this offense has an identity yet? Oh, yeah. We uh, we have a whole bunch of playmakers. And whoever's going to get the ball in their hands is going to make plays. And we got the same identity as last year. We're a tough team, tempo, and we got a strong team. But it seems like you do so many things well that you – it might be difficult to pin one thing you can hang your hat on, right? Oh uh, yeah, we just, we have multiple ways where we go uh, show showcase our offense, and I mean, depending on who we play against. How much of a difference is having a full week of practice going to make? Oh, it's a, a a big difference. We get to uh, we just start the start start the week off tough, a little hitting, a little banging, and then towards the end of the week, it's time to start cleaning things up, getting things sharp, and get ready for the game. A couple of MAC teams had big wins over Power Five conferences. Are you aware of that? Does it help you guys get extra motivated for this game or prepared for this game? I don't uh, pay attention to what's going on around college football. I just worry about uh, this team and what we got to do this week coming up. As you look back on last week, as you went through it, Curtis, was was last week sort of a haze going from Saturday or going from a Monday to playing on a Saturday? I mean, what you know, as you look back on it now, was it asking a little bit much of you guys to get? That well prepared that quickly? Uh, it was definitely, uh, I could say, it was definitely different. Just playing on a Monday game and then having to come in that week yeah. and we got to play it th that Saturday was just a short week for us. Uh, I could definitely say it, it impacted us a little bit, but I felt like we could do better out there.